What a spectacular view indeed. I cannot wait for this battle to commence. Let's join them in the absolute sausage fest. That is the Siege Wolf. Charge, brothers. Danny, it's been a while. Auric. Wait, Auric from Sturgia. Oh my god. He joined the Southern Empire. Minus 100 relationship. As you can see, I've killed all of his friends. Oh wait, is that the general there? He's got very nice armor. Oh, he just went down. Oh, Auric. Get wrecked, son. Welcome back to the channel, Battle Brothers. We're about to lay siege to one of the Southern Empire's castles of Lyceron. But to do so, because it has 351 defenders, 100 more than my own army, we're going to need to summon the Battle Brothers, my friends. The Battle Brothers of Bannerlord II. So if you have a look at our armies, oh, there's Vipon's army is apparently currently sieging Argaron. Argaron, I think, is in the north. Yes, Argaron is close to my empire in the north just here so if he's summoning an army to siege this castle um while we do our work in the southern empire itself this is very promising because the empire's forces are currently split with their war in batania as well and we're just taking advantage of the situation so let's summon the battle brothers and increase our army size these people are only 12 hours away, so obviously I'm going to bring them over to my own army. Absolutely the robber, you can join us too, Battle Brother. Anyone who's close by, essentially, is going to join. People who are a day away can easily join our army. We're going to have a massive strength as soon as we begin this siege and all of our men arise to the occasion. The only chance the enemy have of winning this is if they rush out and attack us immediately right now. That's the only thing they can do against us. Temion is coming over. Perhaps they are plotting something against us, Battle Brothers. Let's go ahead and build a siege engine and a battering ram. This is a giant city we need to capture here. So we're going to be going all out with our siege engines. Because we have to wait for everyone to arrive to the army itself anyway. We better upgrade our looters in preparation for this battle, my brothers. Our army is growing. It's going to be beautiful. We now outnumber the enemy. However, we're still going to build siege engines because they have a castle. A giant castle that will destroy us. Why is he chasing after looters? Can you just join my army, please? I have enough looters in my army, for goodness sake, after that video I made when I encouraged everybody to employ looters for their army. Your spouse, wait, 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 has just learned that she is with child. She's Pragartanant. Pragartanant, brothers. I have sieged my wife once again it seems like every time i'm sieging a castle i'm also sieging my wife yes i'm a master at sieging i mean look at my engineering skill it is improving as i understand the wane of the jow is going to join my battle brother here and we're going to capture another enemy noble beautiful oh there's quite a big army there actually there's quite a big army however Dwayne of the jow i've saved him many times in battle is currently running after them on foot, I might add, because he's an absolute raid boss himself. Battle brothers, let's lead the assault on the enemy. Ha ha ha! Ah, oh, what a beautiful city. Nestled in the mountains of the Southern Empire, as you can see, a beautiful view around. But today, battle brothers, it will be taken by me, the battleborn. I have many forces. We have built a muddy path over the ditches that surround the city in order to lay siege with our siege engines. I am very excited for this battle to take place, brothers. These men are going to the pub, though. What a spectacular view indeed. I cannot wait for this battle to commence. Just for fun, I think I'm going to join my battle brothers on the right-hand siege here. And then I will maybe run through the gate when my men finally reach it. Oh yes, look at this. Ah yes, battle brothers. War is sweet. As you can see, the enemy have already lined their wall with archers. So I'm going to get off my horse here and I'm going to start pelting them with arrows. Beautiful. 29 damage, you say? Get Rex, son. Oh, yes. He's to get a headshot on him. There we go. 93 damage, and he falls from the wall. A limp corpse, indeed. Oh, my goodness. These poor peasants losing their morale as I headshot them right in the face. Should probably take out some of the archers actually doing damage to our troops, though, currently. 
Oh, there you are, brother. Get wrecked. A veteran archer. A veteran of being shot in the head, more like it. That's all these Imperials amount to in their short, short lives. Against my clan of the Battleborns. My kingdom. They will all die a slow death. Oh, I think we just saw some of the battlements there destroyed by the enemy. Can I shoot that guy up there? Oh, I just missed him. Oh, mate. Stop scripting. Stop scripting, brother. There we go. Get ready. Beautiful. Look at that damage. Yes. All these shield brothers on the wall will be no more. Look at these peasants falling to my archer units. Is that a sergeant? I think that's a sergeant of crossbow. I need a dead man. Are there any dead men around here? Look at these looters pushing the siege engine like their life depends on it. I have raised a solid army of battle brothers. Yes. Yes. Siege the castle, my men. Siege it. Ah, oh, yes, here's an arrow. This arrow will find its target in that Imperial. Yes. Yes. Get wrecked, battle brother. Some arrows we can fill up on here. Okay, the siege engine's almost there anyway, so who cares? Actually, I do care. I want... Give me these bows. Yes, 21 arrows. Fantastic, battle brothers. Let's take out these Imperial crossbowmen on the walls here. I want to try and walk up and shoot these guys trying to shoot my men down from the wall to lower them around even further. As you can see, we are slowly winning this battle, brothers. Very slowly, we are destroying their forces on the wall here. I'd say we've lost an even amount of men. However, as soon as we get our men on the battlements there and start to take over their castle, they will be no more, brothers. No more indeed. Indeed! Mate, they are just placing themselves on the wall here to die. We can get that Imperial Crossbowman. Fantastic, he's dead. Right, I can see my battering ram has got up to the center of the fort here. Ideally, we want to flank around with the rest of our men here, though. That is indeed our plan. I don't want to go up just yet, though, because it looks like they have a lot of men left on the wall here. So if I can take them out, that would be ideal. They have a lot of crossbow. Oh, a lot of my men are leaving to go and join the central gate. Clearly, the gate has been knocked down. And we can now join our battle brothers in a onslaught against the siege wall, as it were. Maybe we can take some of these archers out. It seems like my uh, soldiers are doing very well, though, taking these archers out. So we have nothing to worry about there. Let's join them in the absolute sausage fest. That is the siege wall. Charge, brothers! Charge! Yeet! I yeet them over the top here. I'm going to come in behind. Oh, goodness. They're running. They're running from the Battle Brothers. Kill them all. Kill them. Is that a Batanian Finn soldier, I see? Get Rex, brother. Come on, surround them, brothers. Surround them. Surround them in our shield wall, brothers. Push them in. Push them in. Make sure they retreat. Chase them down, brothers. Chase them down. Yes. Our men are spilling into the castle. I only see a slight reserve on the right-hand side of a couple of remaining men forming a final shield wall at the edge of the castle there as my men rain down hell upon them. My army of looters are destroying them. They're extremely veteran levels of troop experience now. Who's shooting the arrow? But as you can see, there is one final archer here. I'm going to yeet him in the face. Yeet him in the face. Look, he's running for his life. Goodness me, that was the last man remaining. And as you can see, my men are flooding into the castle to take hold of it. Take hold of the city battle, brothers. It is ours. It is ours. Oh, yes, look at my men celebrating the bloody slaughter they've just witnessed. I've raised an army of savages. An army of traitorous savages is what we have here. So 100 people have died. 74 were wounded. However, we've killed double on the enemy team. My god. 33 prisoners have been captured. Do you want to resolve the owner of this castle? I do indeed. Okay, so we have a choice here. We can give it to Sichanius. I haven't actually given Sichanius... I've given, given Sichanius one castle so far. 
Lo... Lo Seradon is no longer friends with Regia. In fact, Regia has minus 95 relationship with him after he's taken her castles and stolen his land. So we don't need to worry about him becoming a traitor. He's also the leader of a decent clan. Let's look at Sicinius. He has an age of 32, relation 100 to me. Uh, we are very good friends with him. Now it's 50% for both of these guys to get the castle, so I think I'm going to have the deciding vote here, and I'm going to give it to Sichanius. Now actually, uh, should I give it? No, let's give it to Sichanius. I feel like he can defend this castle better than Meritor, to be honest. You will get the castle, brother. There you go. Enjoy. With majority support. Well done, Battle Brothers. Okay, I really want to chase down these armies next. So I'm going to go ahead and disband my army for now. Oh my god, look at the Southern Empire's strength. We have literally halved it. My goodness. How are they still at war with Batania? Yeah, they're at war with Batania, the Kingdom of Battleborn, the Northern Empire, the Western Empire. Still in civil war, despite these two factions being the weakest in the game, aside from Sturgia. And they're at war with one of the Azurai clans and the Embers of the Flame, whoever they are. Never heard of them in my life. It seems like Argoron has not yet been captured by my allied army. However, I'm going to go ahead and attack one of these guys. But to catch up with them currently, they have a higher movement speed. So we're going to have to disband our army. Which is fine. It's been going for quite a few episodes now. I'll leave um, my friends to track down his party. We're going to attack this party. Haha! -ha! Now, he actually has slightly more men, but Ceradon is joining in with this battle. If you please stop there, I would ask for your name. I'm Danny. Who the hell are you? I am Tynops of the House Elches. Are you actually the leader of your clan? He has minus 100 relationship with us, though. I'm glad to say that we have always taken seriously our duty to protect the common folk of the Empire. Well, in that case, maybe you will join me, because otherwise you will lose all of your common folk. I'm the rightful ruler of this land, and I'd like your support. You may know me as a man of honour. Ineffective. He did not like that at all. He did not agree with us there. Unsurprisingly, I have beheaded many a man. I'm having none of that, Battle Brothers. If you put your interest in the realm first, though. Oh, success. Slight success. Slight success. Okay, we've managed to half convince him, but um, obviously he hates us, so I don't think... We're just going to tell him to surrender or die. I don't want to fight you. I don't care. We fight them. <laughs> Let's go ahead and attack Battle Brothers. Ah, oh, yes. Look at this beautiful field of battle. Let's go ahead and tell our infantry to face the direction of the enemy. That would be really good. And let's tell our archers to come up just here, just in front. And then we're going to get our cavalry to just take over command because they're a lot easier to control themselves. I think the enemy are probably going to be sitting, yeah, in the distance there. So we should be fine. Let's tell our archers, archers to get in a loose formation here. Stand apart! Um, it looks like the enemy are going to be taking defense just over there, though. Infantry forward! Archers forward! I want to move forward a bit because they're not currently doing anything. Move! Just move! get them to move into the tree line there. Infantry forward! Move! Oh, Forward. wow, they're right at the back. Okay, let's just have everyone march up Hot here. Move. They formed a little, little nest, as you can see, on the wall here. I'm going to go in behind them and attack their cab, though. Oh, buddy, you got wrecked. That's a nice spear you have there, buddy. Oh, Tynops. Brother, that was a heavy fall from the saddle you took. Jesus Christ. Don't want to sit on the end of the enemy spears, though, here. 42 damage. How does it feel to have a super long spear, brother? Tell me how it feels. Oh, 27 damage. Battle brothers, where are your archers, eh? Oh, you do have some. That's a nice story, though. Oh, watch out, watch out, watch out. Oh, good. Lucky he had a sword out there. All right, I'm going to go into the back of these calves and swap them out. Rawr! Okay, I kind of failed there. But still, capture this guy over here. Oh, beautiful. The Imperial Elite is dead. And I can go in behind these archers. Do some damage. As we engage in this infantry. 
Charge, brothers! What's going on? Are they running? I'm really confused. Why are all my infantry being so retarded? Get over here and attack. Attack! There we go. For some reason they're like running after fleeing troops instead of attacking all of these archers that are not fleeing. Hold on, battle boys. We lost quite a lot of men there, actually, but the army was considerable. We lost 23 men, and 23 men were wounded. We're at your mercy. You're my prisoner now, Tynops. You silly boy. Ah, 39 prisoners. I'm going to go back and sell those, and we're also going to upgrade our archers to Fian archers. Best archers in the game. We have many. We have many indeed. Many indeed, battle all right, let's go back to our castle and sell all this stuff we have from the war. Um, and this guy is riding off into the sunset, as you guys. Let's go to the tavern district. We could make 12,000 gold by ransoming everyone, but I'm obviously not going to be ransoming any of the nobles. 12,000 gold made from that nice one. All right, we only have a party of 80. However, I think we should be able to catch up this person and attack her. It's just me and you, lady. Danny, it's been a while. Auric! Wait, Auric from Stadia! Oh my god! He joined the Southern Empire! Minus 100 relationship. As you can see, I've killed all of his friends. Apart from his other friend that also joined the Southern Empire. Oh my god, I can't wait to kill him and behead him. You know we're at war, surrender or die. I don't care, yield or fight. I'm not listening to you. <laughs> I don't care, brother. I like how we actually have an even army as well. 80 versus 83. He has slightly more men here. So I'm actually very excited for this. Let's cavalry! tell our cavalry to Sergeant do their own thing. And then I'm going to get my uh, archers over here. And we'll also get them in a loose formation as well. Stand apart! Oh, one sec. Who's this rider coming at me right now? You want to fight me? That is not a good idea. We're going to need to watch out for those... Oh, mate. Azurai Moonat Cavalry. Get wrecked some. Oh, I just missed him. Don't throw the spears at me, please. They hurt a lot. I did not miss those spears of Sturgia. My archers are going to delete this guy, though. Or Ice Child delete him. Okay. This is good. I kind of want to move my archers forward. There we go. We should like, actually probably even make them surrender before they even get to us. Good news. And I'll tell my footman to charge as soon as they get close. Yeah, look, some of them are already retreating by the looks of it. Alright, let's go, brothers. Let's see if I can take out their general for us. Oh, yeah. Sturgeon horse raider. It wasn't their general. I don't even know where their general is. Oh, wait. Is that their general there? He's got very nice armor. Oh, he just went down. Oh, Auric! Get wrecked, son. We're just playing clean up now. Oh, dude. This Empire's army has been destroyed. I mean, it was actually Sturgia's old army. I've been trying to find them and track them down to kill the rest of them, but they're always on the run from me. That's why they joined the Southern Empire, because they're so powerful. So they thought, oh, maybe I'll be able to hide from that crazy... Warlord Danny, who's coming around killing everybody. Oh, yes, look at that. Beautiful. I love the smell of blood in the morning. Two men were wounded. Jesus Christ. That's hilarious. We got 8.7 renown as well. We're taking him out. Auric, you're my prisoner now. I'm going to keep you company, my friend. So I, I want to wipe out all of Sturgia in one go. That would just be so funny. Just to delete their clan from the face of the earth. Uh, let's upgrade these guys. Okay, I'm going to loot all their stuff as well. Fantastic. Okay, that's nice. I can't see any enemies on my screen. I like that. I like that a lot. Just a lot of my clan members and a few mountain bandits, which is fun. Wait a second. Poros has been captured by the Western Empire. How? I wiped out the Western Empire. One sec. I need to have a look at the Kingdoms tab. So, guys, just to show you quickly, Sturgia has a power of 18 now. They lost... <laughs> they have no one left. They have nothing. The Western Empire, however, now has a power of 702. They're actually coming back. The Northern Empire still has a power of 158. We crushed them and they stayed crushed. However, the Western Empire are coming back. They actually own Poros. 
Oh my god, and they've taken this castle as well? Wait a second, how has that happened? The Western Empire must have convinced one of the old Southern Empire lords to join them, because that's the only way I can see them suddenly amounting enough forces to capture two castles. They had nothing before, they had literally nothing. Nothing left. However, now they've captured two castles, that's very interesting. Maybe they are coming back. However, we're not at war with them at the moment, and they've managed to position, them, position themselves completely other side of the map to one another, so I don't think they're really a threat to us. We can sort them out later. That's actually kind of positive to us, because it means the Western Empire is kind of screwed from all sides, really. I think the next thing we want to do is march over to Morina Castle over here and have a look what's going on there. There are some looters here, so we can expand our forces. Very nice indeed. Surrender or die, Brigand. You'll never take us alive. <laughs> Ascend troops. One man was wounded. Okay, great. There's also... Whoa, there's a party of... Oh, I thought it said 103 looters, but it was just 10 and 3. And I want to have a look at this castle. Okay, there's only... A hu there's a 200 defenders in the castle. We could definitely take it. The sun is rising over what will soon be our kingdom battle brothers. And as you can see, one of my clan members is chasing down the Southern Empire army. And I just thought it would be fun to sit around here and not let them escape before we attempt to siege this castle, of course. He has nowhere to go. He just has to run into my own clan member or fight me. Yep. That's close enough. Who are you? I am Danny. Who are you? I am Serrano of the House Hongeros. Oh, I have plus two relationship with you. It is time for me to convince you to join us, brother. I have no wish to fight you. I don't care. So we fight then. I guess we do, battle brother. I guess we do. It looks like I'm going to have to imprison you and the Southern and the Western Empire over here with Nadia, the leader of the Western Empire, is actually attacking your local village as well so i do feel sorry for you battle brother but it turns out i don't really care tell our cavalry to do whatever they like and we'll tell the rest of our men to go ahead and move up because there's quite a few hills in front of us Infantry forward! Archers, move, move! Forward! let's tell our archers to get in a loose, loose formation. formation just ahead of us we actually have a really good view from this tree line here and they're going to have to come down their little slope to actually start doing damage to us. Now, ideally, I'd like the archers to be shooting at the other archers, but it doesn't seem like that's happening. I'm going to get my infantry to charge us soon. But it looks like they actually... They're going to die before they can even get here, to be honest. Infantry charge! It's time to charge in. I can see the enemy general here. He's made a massive mistake. He's already dead, goodness me. You're dead too, Battle Brother. And now we can just charge down the remaining archers. An easy fight indeed. Look at that. Look at them running. Oh my god, how many arrows are in this one tree? That's actually kind of surprising. Alright, let's uh, track down this one guy here and defeat him. Battle Brother. Imperial trained infantryman. He could have been taken prisoner, but I have no time for mercy. We'll be laying siege one day. We didn't lose a single man. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You are my prisoner now, Serenor. That is your real name. Take your men prisoner as well. I mean, upgrade our forest bandits. We have like the best archers in the game really now. And look at all this loot you brought me. Thank you, Battle Brother. All right, there is another army just here. And it's actually quite funny because currently they can't get off this island. <laughs> so I think we're going to take them out before we lay siege to this castle. Where are you going to go, Battle Brother? There's nowhere to you can go. <laughs> ah, hello there, my friend. You have zero relationship. And are you the leader? Are you the only man in this clan? Well, I'm going to give you an opportunity today, sir. You know we're at war, but there's something I'd like to discuss. The chance of you becoming my vassal. What are your thoughts? I am the rightful ruler. I'd ask for your support. Ah, you have not been charmed. This is a bit of a difficult one for us Archer because forward! they have a lot of men here. Stand upon! And they have the higher ground. So I'm just going to sit back a little bit and kind of see what happens. I can see their cav riding around. 
They are just sitting and hugging that hill right now. Okay, I'm going to tell Move my men to go ahead burn! and advance as well. Advance! We'll just get our archers into range though, ideally. Horsemen! Tell our horsemen to do their own thing. Sergeants in charge! We are absolutely pelting them. They're going to have to move because <laughs> we're going to shoot them off their, their land. Got my infantry advancing just in front here. Oh, goodness. What they doing? Come on, charge over there. Right, there we go. The annoying thing is, is when they charge after the enemy horses. And it's like, I know you can't catch them. Come on. All right, well, we've just taken down their general there. And I'm going to go ahead and charge into their archers. Just to make a little bit of chaos. Now they're going to run back into them because the AI is foolish. Is it not Battle Brother? I don't think they have any men left, really. They killed them all, pretty much. You'll eat his liver. You are a savage, sir. A man of my heart, indeed. The enemies are fleeing. Get wrecked. Once again, we've lost zero people. You are my prisoner now, Battle Brother. I'm at your mercy. Indeed you are. Oh, I've got some more looters to add to my party as well. Fantastic. All right, let's go ahead and lay siege to this castle. I could actually call upon my man to help me out here. But I think, to be honest, we might be able to do this on our own. Your relationship has increased by, from five to minus five. Even though they have more men, we actually should be fine laying siege to this battle. He's actually going to raid their village. So obviously they won't be able to do anything and they're going to start starving shortly is always good for us All right, i'm gonna go speed up here as we lay siege yet another castle of the southern empire battle brothers our engineering has increased to level 50 catapults are now 30 percent more effective obviously that's going to be fantastic seems like the southern empire have a bit of an army forming here but i think we're fine really we have time to build at least another siege tower oh valandia and sturgia made Peace. I wonder how. I mean, Sturgy is literally non-existent. They probably couldn't find any Sturgeons to kill. Right, Battle Brothers, we are ready to lead the assault. I have constructed a trebuchet. And there are a few enemy Battle Brothers waiting here. They just really want to watch their enemies die, I think. So let's go ahead and lead this assault. Now, this is really interesting because there is a trebuchet that you can put here. But I'm actually kind of interested to see what happens if we put it on the left-hand side just here. Because that is a much better view for us to absolutely yeet the enemy walls. So I'm going to put that there. And then I've also got enemies. And I've also got our battering ram going up the hill here. And also our siege engine going on the right hand side of these walls there. And yeah, I think I might try and join the left hand flank. Though I have no idea how to even get to this siege engine up here. So let's figure that out. Begin the assault battle, brothers. All right, I'm going to go right up. And I'm going to operate my trebuchet. It's kind of weird. like it's, it's really hard to get to the position of the trebuchet right now. Let's get off the horse. Hopefully it's already loaded because, yeah, it's already loaded. I can already fire the first bombs at the enemy castle battle, brothers. How exciting indeed. Okay, I'm just going to yeet it, and hopefully that's measured out correctly. There she goes! Over the wall! I don't think we actually hit anyone there. Don't worry, Battle Brothers. We need we need some more stones. Have you got any stones? Where are they? Just some rocks somewhere. Did we forget to bring any ammo? There's no ammo. Wait, where are you going? Is there some hidden in the grass? That's my horse, buddy. Okay, so I don't think our trebuchet has any ammo. It had one shot. It was worth... It took me two days to construct that trebuchet, and it was definitely worth the one shot I got out of it. So I indeed am a very happy man. All right, let's uh, try and dismount here and can help our battle brothers without hopefully getting an arrow to the face here. Oh, a nice shot there, battle brother. Get wrecked, son. The Imperial spy. You will die. Yes. Beautiful. The culling shall begin today, Battle Brothers. Another man is dead. Oh, he's aimbotting me. 
Look at them trying to hide from me behind their walls. Don't even try and shoot me with that arrow, brother. There you go, get wrecked, son. These guys are absolutely pincushioned with arrows. That one's actually my follower, that guy who's tanked about 10 arrows to the face. Oh, mate, how smooth this criminal is. I can see you up there, brother. Get wrecked, son. There's a guy in there, too, but I just can't... He's aimbotting me. Beautiful, 171 damage. Here comes the Siege Tower Battle Brothers. We're going to have to fill up on arrows the enemy's using against us. Here we go. Are you ready for this battle, brothers? Get wrecked, son. Kill them all. None shall survive. Look at this guy, Leonidas. He is now dead. He's hiding from me. I think I might join the battering ram team. Or should I join the siege team? Looks like there's a lot of men on the walls there, guys. Get wrecked, son. And use up my arrows, shooting these guys down from the siege tower. It looks like they have overcome the enemy. Are they retreating off the wall there? I'm not sure. Come, Battle Brothers, we must take the fortress. Attack the gates, brothers. Well done. Look at my veteran soldiers ready for the battle. Charge! Rawr! Watch out for that peasant battle, brother. Direct. Charge! Yes! Look at them flood through the gates. Well done. Kill them all indeed. Don't worry, brother. I've got your back. Look out there, you silly man with a hammer. They just killed someone. Goodness me, that wasn't very nice. It wrecks up. Retreat! Make them retreat, battle brothers. Chase them back to their camp. Or wherever they hail from. Yes, look at that slaughter. I can see one guy over there on the battlements just minding his own business. Well, oh, he's dead now. How about his friend? Also dead. Get wrecked, son. There you go. We've only lost 19 people and 50 were wounded. We destroyed the enemy army in force, though. Our armor was no match. I know I'm over the prisoner limit, but I don't care because I've just captured a castle, Battle Brothers. Well, the enemy forces are strong here. Just to show you guys, by the way, we are on realistic difficulty. We just have highly trained troops, so, I mean, it's obviously going to be easier. You don't, they don't dare fight me. They know. I'm going to give it to Ceridon, I think. It's between these two guys. Merit already has a lot of land. I'm going to give it to uh, Ceridon. There you go, Battle Brother. Enjoy. Oh, our looters can be upgraded, though. And then you, you can take the wounded ones. <laughs> there you go. Four wounded looters will protect this castle. All right, my friends, I'm going to end today's episode of Mountain Blade 2 Banner Lord here. I hope you enjoyed it. I will see you in the next one. The whole playlist, by the way, guys, is linked down below. You can just follow along with each episode. I think there's a couple of guides in between, but you can just skip those and you can find every episode essentially in the playlist. That's the best way to kind of follow along with the Let's Play if you guys are getting lost.